God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. The martyrs living now with Christ in suffering were tried. Their anguish overcome by love when on his cross they died. Across the centuries they come in constancy unmoved. Their loving hearts make no complaint, in silence they are proved. No man has ever measured love or weighed it in his hand. But God, who knows the inmost heart, gives them the promised land. Praise Father, Son, and Spirit, blessed to guide us through the night in ways that reach beyond the stars to everlasting light. Lord, keep my soul from death, my feet from stumbling. I love the Lord, for he has heard the cry of my appeal. For he turned his ear to me in the day when I called him. They surrounded me the snares of death with the anguish of the tomb. They called me sorrow and distress. I called on the Lord's name. O Lord, my God, deliver me. How gracious is the Lord and just. How God is compassion. The Lord protects the simple hearts. I was helpless, so he saved me. Turn back my soul to your rest, for the Lord has been good. He has kept my soul from death, my eyes from tears, and my feet from stumbling. I will walk in the presence of the Lord, in the land of the living. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, for ever and ever. Lord, keep my soul from death, my feet from stumbling. My help shall come from the Lord, who made heaven and earth. I lift my eyes to the mountains, from where shall come my help? My help shall come from the Lord, who made heaven and earth. May he never allow you to stumble, let him sleep not your God. No, he sleeps not nor slumbers, Israel's God. The Lord is your God and your chain. At your right side he stands. By day the sun shall not smite you, nor the moon in the night. The Lord will guard you from evil. He will guard your soul. The Lord will guard your going and coming, both now and forever. 
Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever. The God who is, who was, and is to come, at the end of the ages. My help shall come from the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Your ways are just and true, King of all the ages. Great and wonderful are your deeds, O Lord God the Almighty. Just and true are your ways, O King of the ages. Who shall not fear and glorify your name, O Lord? For you alone are holy. All nations shall come and worship you, for your judgments have been revealed. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Your ways are just and true, King of all the ages. My dear people, if you can have some share in the sufferings of Christ, be glad, because you will enjoy a much greater gladness when his glory is revealed. It is a blessing for you when they insult you for bearing the name of Christ, because it means you have the spirit of glory the Spirit of God resting on you. You have tested us, God, and you have brought us out into freedom again. You have tested us, God, and you have brought us out into freedom again. You have refined us like silver, you have tested us, God, and you have brought us out into freedom again. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. You have tested us, God, and you have brought us out into freedom again. We celebrate in one victim the reward of both purity and religious devotion. This saint remained a virgin and also attained the martyr's crown. My soul glorifies the Lord, my spirit rejoices in God my Saviour. He looks on his servant in a lowliness. Henceforth all ages shall call me blessed. The Almighty works marvels for me. Holy is name. His mercy is from age to age. On those who fear him. He puts for his arm in strength. And scared as the proud hearted, he casts the mighty from their thrones, and raises the lowly. He fills the starving wicked things, sends the rich away empty. He protects his really servant, remembering his mercy. The mercy promised to our fathers, to Abraham and his sons forever. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever, world without end. We celebrate in one victim the reward of both purity and religious devotion. This saint remained a virgin, and also attained the martyr's crown. Let us give thanks to the King of Martyrs, for this is the hour when he offered himself in the Last Supper, and laid down his life on the cross. We praise you, Christ the Lord. We praise you, Christ our Saviour, example and strength of the martyrs, because you have loved us to the end. We praise you, Christ the Lord. 
because you have promised repentant sinners the reward of eternal life. We praise you, Christ the Lord, because you have called the church to offer the blood of the new and eternal covenant, the blood shed for the remission of sins. We praise you, Christ the Lord, because you have brought us to this day with the gift of faith intact. We praise you, Christ the Lord, because of the many brothers who today have come to share in your saving death. We praise you, Christ the Lord, at the Saviour's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Almighty ever-living God who gave St. Catherine of Alexandria to your people as a virgin and an invincible martyr. Grant that through her intercession we may be strengthened in faith and constancy and spend ourselves without reserve for the unity of the Church. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.